All right, guys. It is a spectacularly gorgeous spring day here in the former paradise of South Austin, Texas, where I have returned to your old pathetic internet addict has returned to so he can get back to his little sugar tit called the internet here. But it's a good thing I did here on Wednesday afternoon April 26, 2017, because I got some pleasant house cleaning to do. Of course, one thing I wanted to do, which I was unable to do this morning, was to go into my own um, Humpty Dumpty Tribe mailbag for the comment of the day for uh, from Alert Tribes members. Good God! took me an hour to get through all the comments. This was really a challenge. There's so many comments I would love to share with you, but we're gonna, I just kind of threw a dart and went with a comment from this fellow named Thomas Ward. Thomas Ward has a gripe, has a gripe with Hambone. Hambone. I have been viewing your rants for about the last eight months. I really appreciate your no-shit Sherlock view of what is occurring on this planet and your deadpan, credulous comic timing. What I do not condone, however, is you or anyone using pussy as a word to convey weakness and ineptitude. You have a legitimate critical viewpoint, but using that word in that way undermines your concern for the planet by reinforcing systematic oppression of some of its inhabitants, namely women. If you want to call out someone for a lack of fortitude in the face of the shitstorm of reality with a sex organ, why not call them a penis instead? Penises are typically limp, withdrawing, and demurring to the task at hand. Well, some penises might uh, argue that point, of course. Indeed, you are more accurate to castigate the limp dick environmentalists. Your friend, Thomas. My response to Thomas was, okay, if it makes you happy, Humpty Dumpty Tribe is not for limp dick mainstream environmentalists either. So I've actually had rants about this word pussy. I love the word pussy. I just think it's a great word. I actually went on to Wikipedia, looked up pussy on Wikipedia, and find there's actually three things that pussy refers to. It refers to a cat. Where are you, you little pussy? A cat, usually the small domesticated variety. The second uh, reference of pussy refers to female genitalia. And third, separate from cat or female genitalia, is an insult indicating weakness or cowardice, which is, of course, uh, the, the use I'm using of the word pussy when I say that Humpty Dumpty tribe is not for pussies. Uh, this is no uh, denigration of pussies. I love pussies. I, I, I think pussy is one of the great inventions of, uh, on the planet the reason that I have had no encounters with a pussy in however many years has nothing to do with my distaste for pussies. 
Uh, it's simply the fact that the rest of the the uh, person that the pussy is attached to is usually about 10 minutes after they open their mouths that uh, that somehow I'm just a lot less interested in their pussy. But anyway, I think I'm getting myself in enough trouble over this. So, uh, you know, just the old fantasy of, of meeting a, a deaf mute woman. Uh, but anyway, let's not get off onto this. I, I absolutely uh, mean no offense to two pussies anybody on the planet who owns a pussy by suggesting simply because you have a pussy that you are a pussy. Uh, anyway, Humpty Dumpty Tribe is not for pussies or limp dick mainstream environmentalists. But with the comment of the day out of the way here, uh, and that ham bone amplification and clarification of his view of pussies and people who own them. Uh, I'm going to move on now to, uh, to a couple of other house cleaning items, as it were. Be right back at you. Bye, guys.